all what is up gamers this is expo and welcome back with another video guys today i'm going to provide you brand new cpu overclock epk app by which you can optimize cpu clock speed and the boost gaming and the device performance this app doesn't require root permission guys this app is mainly to boost cpu performance and if you are a hardcore gamer and facing lag and fps setters while playing games then this app will fix all these problems so guys without wasting your time let's get start the video so first of all download the file from the link after download extract the file then install the apk app and when it's done simply open the app here disable the phone permission because it's a useless to give phone permissions now tap on continue then again tap on ok so guys this is the interface of this app now follow my steps here you can see maximum and the minimum cpu frequency so max cpu frequency should be in max and the minimum cpu frequency would be also in max speed now tap on scaling and here select performance then enable the set on boot then tap on apply to save these settings after this go to the profile section here leave the charging and the screen off option just scroll down and come to the in call options first enable these options then tap on scaling model and select performance now tap on max cpu frequency and select max cpu speed then tap on minimum cpu frequency and select second last cpu speed according to your device cpu speed now come to low battery and enable these options too now tap on battery lower then here set battery between 30 to 35 percentage then scaling model should be in performance mode and here same as before max cpu frequency at max and for minimum cpu frequency select this now come to temperature overheat and enable these options first then tap on temperature above and here select temperature between 45 to 50 degrees celsius now tap on scaling model and select interactive instead of performance because it may harm when your device temperature is high and your scaling is in performance mode so better set in interactive mode now tap on max cpu frequency and select max speed and the minimum cpu frequency would be lowest speed of cpu do not set in max speed after setting all these go to advanced sections and guys uh, my gpu control is not supporting if your gpu control will support then you can control your gpu speed but in my device it's not working so leave this step now tap on io scheduler and here select cfq now come to the sample rate and here add sample rate 2 4 3 times 0 then enable the set on boot and then tap on apply to save these settings so guys everything is done in this app now open set edit app and add a few commands to make these settings more stable now simply tap on add new settings and add the commands so the first command is ro dot freq dot cpu underscore scaling underscore control then tap on save changes and value would be 1 now add another command and the command is access dot control dot cpu underscore sec underscore android underscore power snd now add the value and the value would be true now add last commands and the command is ro dot service dot sys underscore cpu dot swap interval the value would be 1 now simply go back to the home page and reboot or restart your device once and guys one more thing that after restart when you open this app some settings would be reset automatically but don't worry all setting is applied already when you tapped on apply so you don't need to apply again 
Just uh, close the app and open your game and enjoy super smooth gaming without any lag or APS shutters issue. So guys I hope you enjoyed this video and if my videos are informative then kindly like this video and also subscribe my channel to support me. You can also follow me on Instagram and join my telegram channel to stay updated. So that's all for today see you next video till then take care and signing out. Fuck up in the pants